Gently, uh, gently. Ah, Jesus, Lee, what are you trying to do? Bite it off. Relax, my little kitty cat. Trickle Dan's got it all in check. I'm gonna eat you up like truffle butter. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm trying to stack up my paper. That will fuck up a hater. The only time when they hold up is when they need you for favors. You the. How are you finding it, Danny? Oh, um, yeah, it's fine. Just like trying to get my head around processing all the numbers and stuff. It's a lot. Don't worry. You'll soon be doing it in your sleep, like me. Oh, you should get some photos for your desk. I've got my Terry here. Oh. Anyway, uh, so if you want to see Bedroom 3 again, we can. It's, as I say, they're ready for an offer. Yeah, um, you know the car in the driveway? Does that come with the house? No. Oh. Well, that's misleading. Uh, OK, it's, it's just that this is your third viewing and they really are ready to sell up. Yeah, the thing is, I, I really thought that the car came with the house, so for that reason, I'm out. Thanks, Martin. Oh, um, do you think they'd mind if I took some loo roll? Thank you. Cherry, cherry, cherry. And this is another picture of our sofa. <laughs> yeah. We had to get a new one because the dog was sick everywhere. Yeah. Terry wanted a red one again. <laughs> but I said, no, let's get beige. And we argued about it for months, and in the end, we ended up getting a blue one. <laughs> Oh, Spencer will be back soon. Yeah, we better keep it down. Yeah, but bit strict, man. Oh, he's a funny one, Spencer. Like, do you think he'd care if I had, like, a couple of days off in June for a festival? <laughs> June? Oh, come on, that's our busiest month. I don't think you'll have much luck. <laughs> June. <laughs> right. Let's have a meeting. Cherry, cherry, cherry. The thing is, Jerry, how will any of us know if we've ever made the right decisions in life, you know? Oftentimes, you find yourself in a dilemma, two roads, as Robbie Frozzle said, diverged in a wood. The wood being a metaphorical symbol for life itself. Will you fuck off? Right, so, firstly, Danielle, welcome to the team. I think it's best that we start by just reiterating the office guidelines. I don't appreciate noise. I don't like mobile phones out on the desks, and I have zero tolerance for more than two toilet breaks in a day. You drink less, piss less. Simple. Any questions? Sorry, yeah, just in regards to the toilet roll, I do often need to use the loo. Why is that, sorry? I just often need to go. But why? Um... Well, you can yeah. share with us. We're all colleagues now, some might say. Family. No, no, of, of course, of course. Um, well, it's just that I uh, have IBS. I have IBS. Well, what is that, sorry? Is that when you shit yourself? N no, I don't, <laughs> I don't shit myself. Do you have one of those bags? No, I don't, I don't have a bag. It's, I don't. <laughs> The 90s was the renaissance sort of UK pop, I'm telling you. Dane Bowers puked himself right there. I'm gonna take you on a journey where they all used to hang out. We're talking about Atomic Kitten, Hearsay, and on the left you could see the spot in which Daniel Bedingfield penned a smash hit, I Gotta Get Through This. Classic early 90s tune, that. Released 2002. Now follow me as I take you through the legacy of the king of pop himself, Gareth Gates and his sordid affair with the one... Hello there. Would you like to try a free sample of Lucky Bread's new triple cheese bloomer? Baked fresh this morning. What did you say this place was called again? Lucky Bread. Oh, my God! Cherry, cherry, I will cherry. monitor transactions, and then I will um, liaise with accounts to ensure the correct balance has been transferred. And then, when that's done, I'll input all the data into an Excel spreadsheet. Oh, well done. Is that your mobile phone, hmm? Daniel? Ah, uh, um, ah, oh, yes, yes, it is. I'm so sorry. It's, it's my mum, and I, I'm going to have to take this. It's, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'll just be, I'll be two seconds. Sorry, just two minutes. 
Mate, there you are. Georgie, it's my first day at work. Oh, yeah, how's it going? It's fucking shocking. What is this about? Do you remember the night that we met the guy who thought he was Dolly Parton, but then we were so hungry that we had to leave him and go and find food? Georgie, it's my first day at work, OK? And you said this was important. Goodbye. No, D Danny, do not hang up the phone. I mean this. This is important. Please stay on the line. OK. Do you remember where we were? Probably Chicken Shack? No, 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 cos I could still eat wheat at this point. What has wheat in it? Wheat? Wheat, wheat! What can't I eat? I don't know. Bread? Yes! And we hadn't been in the city for very long and we were wandering around what we now know is Brick Lane. Wee wee? Yes. OK, and um, we had the most incredible cheese toasties of our entire lives, CC. Yes. Well, guess what I found this morning? No! Yes, I found the place! No! <gasps> Oh, my God! Oh, no. Well, She looks really upset. <laughs> no! Well, what do I do now? Well, you need to come here now, Danny, or we'll never find it again. It's like Diagon Alley. It'll be gone as soon as I leave. I'm sending you Milo KK. <sighs> She's coming back. She's coming... Sorry, um... Yeah, so, like, I've... I just ha had a call in this emergency. It's, like, way bigger than I thought. Um, I've just received some life-changing news <gasps> and I'm going to have to take the rest of the day to, you know, like, to regroup, so... I is it your mother, sweetheart? Hmm? Yeah. Yeah, it's my mum, so... I'm, I'm going to go. Well... <laughs> what's actually wrong with her? Well, um... Well, it's... it's the... It's she. It's her. It's her, the, her pain. Oh no! Not the pancreas. Hmm? <gasps> Cancer. What? Oh God! Oh poor love. It'll be great. Okay. Oh. oh, so sorry, Danielle. How long has she actually got left? Um. 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 She she has about seven and a half, eight point five, eight eight and a half weeks. <gasps> oh no! Well, go go. You just you just let us know that you're okay. Okay. All right. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you all. Give Bye. her a kiss from me. Um. Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. God, I've thought about you. And they do gluten-free bread now. Of course they do. Mmm! God damn, this is so good. I'm going to eat you up. Why are you talking like that? What's wrong, Trevor? Don't talk like that. OK, sorry. <laughs> OK, would you rather go down on Bin Laden for five minutes or ruin Donald Trump for two? Um. Has Trump had a shower? No. But neither has Bin Laden. OK. Can I bring Hillary Clinton into this discussion? For what? For cunnilingus. No, that's cheating. Bin Laden. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to stack up my paper, then we'll f up a hater. The only time when they holler is when they need you for favours.